There was a big bang, and out of the cataclysm came a lot of things, many of them good. One of the best was United Therapeutics, and I was happy to be a part of it. Hi, I'm Bill Rock. I'm the creative director for United Therapeutics. In my travels, I'm often asked, who is Martine Rothbaum? I usually answer Martin. Martin is the CEO and chairman of United Therapeutics. But lately I've been wondering myself, just who is Dr. Rothblatt? So I've come here to the Unithair Education Center to find out a little more. Now, this isn't helping. I think what we'll need to do is talk to a few more folks. Have you ever seen her before? Her name is Martine Rothblatt. Hi. We're here in New York City. I'm trying to find out a secret of Martine. I am feeling the Martine vibe. People say to me all the time, what does Martine represent to you? I think she represents the soul of United Therapeutics. We are Martine Rothblatt. <laughs> I could go on and on. She's she's a wonderful person. Hey, does Martine Rothblatt come here? Martine Rothblatt, does she ever come here to eat? You don't you don't know? Does she live around here? Mart oh she does. When she found out that Genesis was ill, she did what any mother would do. She went back to school, got a PhD, and launched a biotech company. Martine had a vision to provide alternative treatment and non-invasive treatments to patients with pulmonary hypertension, which started with her daughter, Genesis. The genesis of United Therapeutics was to serve patients from the very beginning, and we haven't lost sight of that. Having this news that my child was sick and that there wasn't any available treatment for her, I probably would have holed up in a closet and just wept, you know, but Martine like went out and started a company and, and found a treatment for this disease. See her start from on the daughter having a problem to today having so many people Medicine for life, it's the greatest. Whenever there's been a problem that she was interested in solving, she just tackled it. Whether she had any previous training in it or experience, I mean, to go from, from satellites to, to biotech to xenotransplantations is a pretty amazing trajectory. With Martine's leadership, we have accomplished so many things and still are. And I don't think any of us can thank her enough for what she's done for the company and actually the world. I found some books here by Martine Rothbard. These do not help tell us who she really is. Nothing's impossible. Oh boy, describe Martine in 20 words or less. I don't think that's possible. <laughs> 20 words or less. Um, okay. 20 words or less. Uh, that, that's tough. I think it's gonna be more than 30 words. <laughs> uh, I, I get it. <laughs> can, can you do it in 20 words? Happy. Incredibly smart, joyful, generous, kind, sensitive, loving. And I can't describe Martine without saying Bina. They, they are one, and they are Marbina. Leader, builder, fun loving, pragmatic, down to earth, intense, focused, compassionate. Friend. Well, I've never met Martine, <laughs> so I don't know. 
Ed, can you, you want to keep on going? Fun loving, um, crazy. I, I can't do the 20 words. Wow, I don't know any other way to describe her. I just think she's, I just think she's great. I think she's a great person. I would describe Martine Rothblatt as a friend, uh, an accomplice, uh, a visionary, no doubt. Enthusiastic, entrepreneurial, excited, creative, motivating. Upbeat, positive, um, heart, heartwarming, family-centric. Brilliant, fair, demanding, the ultimate entrepreneur. She's got that innate gut instinct about people and products and the course of how things are going to turn out. Incredibly strong. Very much connects with people. Culturally uh, diverse. Just starting the company up and, and taking it to where it is today uh, it just takes a, a brilliant visionary. Business savvy. A good person. Um, what we call down south, good folk. Tommy Life too. <laughs> just a joy to work with. She knows how to motivate people and she's she's down to her. A down to earth visionary. She has created something where there literally was nothing. She can see things the way others cannot. She is very generous while also demanding a lot of people but being fair at the same time. She is uh, an incredibly dynamic thinker. She can get the potential out of anybody. The creativity is through the roof. When you're around her, you can't help but be affected by her. The will and determination that she has to accomplish her goals is something I've never seen before. Having worked for Martine for seven years, I grew more in those seven years than I did in my entire 25-year career. She is someone that you will learn from day in and day out. That's the beauty of uh, working for Martine. Uh, she challenges you, challenges you um, all the time, um, all the time. So, and it just helps you keep your game up. There's an energy about her that is incredibly uncommon, um, incredibly rare, and I think that's the life force of UT. Rules don't apply, which I think is a phenomenal way to run an organization and to continue to grow and inspire people. It's an open door policy. She can frustrate the hell out of you sometimes because most of us can't keep up with her. What you learn when you join as a Unitharian is you start to learn how approachable she is, how warm, caring, and compassionate she is. I love her as a person. I like her style. She's very diplomatic in everything that she does. She goes out of her way to, to, to let you know that she appreciates your work. Martine herself is a very fun-loving person. There's something about her positive energy that drives people. 24-7, she's continued to work. I don't know how she does it. Uh, she's not stuck in any program. She's not doing things the way she did them at Pfizer or Merck or Big Pharma because she wasn't there. She's an entrepreneur. So that inspires an energy and a vibrancy that day to day makes things fun. She's the master of everything she does. She's got a lack of fear. Martine doesn't do things halfway. There's like an absence of any potential for intimidation, uh, even conceptually. She is all in, all the time. The first time I really got to know her, she came in and she gave me this big hug. And you don't expect a CEO to hug you. <laughs> Always there with a hug. It takes a really getting used to see so you know, giving you hugs. When she embraces something and becomes passionate about something, then she owns it. It all goes back to helping people. Very, you know, pleasant, warm. Someone who encourages innovation. She wants to change, make a difference in this world. And she starts with us, her employees. She wants to cure the whole world. If she can, and that attitude about her, I love it. I love it, and it makes me come to work and like, okay, you know what, if she's willing to do all these things, then why don't I just take, do my part? It's the freedom and the openness by which she runs this organization that lends its success to. It sets the stage for excitement and keeps you engaged and keeps you wanting to see what's gonna happen next.
great stories about Martine. There, there's hundreds. Oh, this is a great story. Oh, I, I'm sorry, I can't tell that one. It's still under court seal. No, no I'm sorry. They're all, they're all secretive. Only the priest and I know. When Tyvesa was approved, and she was so excited, she was running through the halls of RTP. You know, there's just, there's such joy. And I remember the person on the other phone going, what the hell was that all about? And I said, well, I think we just got one of our drugs approved. I arrive at the second floor, and she comes rushing on with a granola bar hanging out of her mouth. I was standing over by Renika's cubicle, so I said, well, hi, Martine. And she turned around, and she says, oh my gosh, you're just the person I'm looking for. Happy birthday. Martine and I and others uh, went down to Blacksburg, Virginia to do our first due diligence visit of a Revivacor's facility in their farm. And Martine was clearly like a kid in the candy store. Music is a very strong passion of hers, and I would like to think of UT as a, as a little company that, that rock and rolls. We put on a good show, uh, we fill the house, uh, and people come back for more. I believe you're holy and the whole cosmos Thanks, honey. Thanks, honey. Getting videos of her snowmobiling down the side of a mountain and then getting an exhaustive budget review an hour later. She just has this ability to sort of shape shift and be everywhere at once. Martine likes videotaping. She likes taking pictures. She loves taking pictures. And she'll post her pictures on the YouTube. Her life is like an open book. Hi, Martine. Uh, this is Ola. I just want to say thank you. Thank you, Martine, for the opportunity to be here. I am a very proud Unitarian. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to work on uh, bringing a biologic to market. I can't even express all the different things that I've learned. Thank you for forming this company. I really like everything that you're doing. It's amazing. I love it here. Martine, you know, I think you, you really do bring out the best in people. Uh, I just want to say thank you for, your, uh, for the opportunities you've given me. Thank you so much for starting this company. Martine, thanks for um, bringing me aboard the UT family. Martine, thank you so much for all that you've done for the community of patients. Uh, Martine, I've been extremely um, blessed to have been working with you um, for, for the last 11 years. Martine, uh, thank you for, for having the, the, the faith in, in me. Thank you so much for all that you've done for me, for UT, for the PH community. I'd want to thank Martine for her passion to develop new treatments for life-saving therapies and for her talent to take us to one of the top biotech companies in the world. It's been wonderful working with you, Martine, for the last 13 years, and I look forward to working with you another 13 years. Um, it's, it's just been a phenomenal time. Despite any challenges that we've had, I feel like you've always supported the organization and you've always really believed in um, believed in the employees. It's a, just an incredibly good feeling to watch all the success that's taken place in the company in the last few years. I know you're very proud. Everyone is very proud of you. I'm incredibly proud of you. We're helping patients. Now we're helping people. And that's a that's a great gift. Oh, Martine, thank you for this wonderful opportunity uh, to be involved in this great adventure. I just want to say thank you for eight and a half wonderful years. You're a great mentor, a great friend, and a great boss. Martine, baby, uh, it's been a great ride. Uh, let's take the brakes off and keep going. Mwah. I love working for you. I love being your friend and your colleague. And. You know, I can't, there's, I can't speak to you without also thanking Dina. I think, Dina, we love you too, and thanks for all you do for all of us at United Therapeutics.